Good morning, children. So today we are going to write the question answers of lesson number one: natural resources, air, water, and land. So yesterday we finished about the land. Now let's write question answers. First question is the fill in the blank. First one. The layer of ozone. The layer of ozone gas absorb the layer of ozone gas absorbs dash okay write down dash rays that come from rays that come from the sun to the earth from the sun the earth so answer will be the ultra violet ultra violet rays then b write down of the total water of the total water available water available on the earth Oh, fresh fresh water forms dash per se so answer will be the 0.3 percent okay see both dash and dash constituents are present in the soil which constituent both biotic and a bio biotic and a biotic okay constituent are present in the soil you have to write down this answers in copy everyone write down then question number 2 write down Second question: Why is it 
said that okay the question one is ozone layer is a protective shell of the earth why did say we say the ozone layer is protective shell of the earth okay there are the many reasons why ozone layer is important so let's write this answer answer okay the uv rays uv rays means ultraviolet rays coming coming from the sun from the sun are very harmful very harmful for living things living things okay then the ozone layer present in the present in the lower stratosphere lower stratosphere lower stratosphere absorb the UV rays so these UV rays and prevent them and prevent them from reaching the earth from reaching the earth okay from reaching the earth as a result as a result life on the earth life on the earth is protected is protected life on the earth is protected okay this is the reason write down this okay then second question 
what b1 is water is life okay write down the answer why water is life you know we cannot live without water water is very essential water is good solvent water is good solvent and it dissolves it dissolves many substances it dissolves many substances human solvent also human blood also consist seventy percent of water. Okay. And sap of plant, sap of plant, sap of plant also contains water. Okay. all life processes all life processes would not take place would not take place would not take place in absence of water in absence of water hence hence without water without water without water no living organisms organisms hence without water no living organisms can survive can survive okay can survive and stop here therefore it is said therefore it is said that water is life water is life okay it's the importance of water so write down this answer then we write the third one third lesson third answer write down question is
Sea water is useful. Sea water is useful. Sea water is useful even though. Even though it is not potable, it is not potable. Okay, we say no has no sea water has no use. We say, but the sea water is useful even though it is not a. For table water, okay. You know the sea water is salty. We get various salts and minerals from the sea water. Lots of thing we get from the sea water. So let's write down the reason why it is said to be useful water. Okay, let's write, children. Answer. Many fish. fish and aquatic animals and aquatic animals fish and aquatic animals live in sea water Live in sea water. Okay. Sea water evaporates. Sea water evaporates. You know the large quantity of water is present in the sea, so that sea water evaporates to form clouds. And clouds help for rain. Okay, which brings rain. brings which brings rain the salts and the salts and minerals are also the salts and minerals are also obtained from sea water obtained from obtain from sea water corals and pearls corals q o r a sorry c o r a l s and pearls Chunk and shimple. Okay, pearls, moti, pearls are also obtained are also obtained from sea animals. from
see animals see animals okay the sea water sea water is useful is useful even though it is even though it is not potable okay children so we have written these answers why is it said that three questions the answers we have written and we also completed the fill in the blanks now you have listen your homework you have to learn all these theory answers okay so next period we will continue with another exercise next exercise okay bye children